In this video, I'm going to show you how I add captions to my LinkedIn videos without using any expensive video software or having to transcribe my videos. Coming up. Hey, my name is Luke Sievers with One9 Pro. I'm a brand designer and LinkedIn content creator. If you want to get more tips for growing your business on LinkedIn, be sure and hit that subscribe button. So the majority of the content that I post on LinkedIn is video content. And so I'm constantly adding LinkedIn captions because I've found that it actually can help to increase my engagement and my views. Because if you think about it, not everybody scrolling through LinkedIn is able to watch with their sound on. So adding subtitles to your LinkedIn videos can actually help more people to watch all the way through, even on mute. So to do this, I want to introduce you to an amazing video captioning tool called Zubtitle. Now this can help you do one of two things. You can either burn your captions into the bottom of the video and style those captions, or you can use it to export an SRT file. An SRT file is basically a caption file, which you can then upload to LinkedIn and use LinkedIn's captioning feature. Either way, it's totally free to sign up and try out Zubtitle. So let's jump in. So what we're going to do to start is visit Zubtitle.com and sign up for an account. And for me, I'm just going to log in to my existing account. And so here you can see some of the drafts I'm working on, uh, but I'm going to now upload a new video here and you can drag it in pretty easily like this. This is a video that is a kind of a micro piece of content from one of my longer YouTube videos and I'm going to be posting it on LinkedIn. So it'll just take a few moments to upload and then what it's going to do is actually transcribe the whole video and you'll see the transcript in just a moment. All right, so there we go. You can kind of see the transcript that generated right here. Let's go ahead and just click play and watch just a little bit of it so you can see what we got here. Now gaining connections and building your network on LinkedIn is great, but it's not everything. In order to build that community that you need to have on LinkedIn and also build your personal brand, you need to be creating thought leader content. Awesome. So you can see how it just automatically added the captions to the bottom there. And what we can do really easily in here, because it's not a completely perfect system, is we can go and make any corrections we need to. Uh, so let's kind of see what we want here. Maybe remove that comma. Not everything, add a period. Make this a new sentence. And then also what we can do is if we want to kind of change the way the captions appear down here, if we want them to be shorter, if we want them to be on one line, we can do that. And I tend to like mine to be on one line. So what we can do is kind of go in here. Now gaining connections and building your network on LinkedIn is great, but it's not everything. And we'll just add a caption break right there. In order to build your community that you need to have on LinkedIn, and also build a personal brand. Of course, we need to add a, this is not the end of the sentence. You need to be creating thought leader content. And so what I'm gonna do is just then go through the rest of this and uh, kind of edit this as I need to. And it just takes a few minutes to do that. So what we can actually do at this point is actually style our captions and style the entire video if we want to. Uh, what I actually like to do is kind of change the aspect ratio from widescreen to square, because I think square works pretty well on LinkedIn. It, it seems to take up a lot of real estate in both the um, mobile and desktop news feed. So then what we can do is also add a headline, create thought leader content on LinkedIn. So that you can see that it starts off with a headline and a caption style uh, that kind of match each other. But what I actually want to do is change both those things, especially the captions, to match my branding. So I actually have already created um, styles for this. So let me start with the headline style here and find my headline and then also my caption style. And so actually what I also want to do is change the background of the top and bottom border here. Um, so we can go down here and I'm just going to quickly grab my one nine pro blue color, paste it in here. Sweet. And so we can also do one more thing and just kind of, uh, reposition these. Uh, so the headline, we might want to move it down just a little bit. And then for the captions, want to fine tune that and move that up and kind of center it there. Yeah. So that's looking pretty cool. Of course, I could also kind of zoom myself 
in and out if I want to. So now if you want to add a custom style for your captions like this, you can just click on Manage Fonts and Colors, and here's all the ones that I have saved. Let's uh, kind of click on the existing one I have here. We'll do Edit. So you'll see here that we can actually name our style. We can select from a bunch of different uh, Google fonts if we want to. We can increase the text size if we want to, change the background color. We can make it full width if we want to, add some text shadow. There's just a bunch of options in here. So I just wanted to show you that, but I'm just gonna exit out so it won't actually save that and we'll kind of keep it the way it was. All right, so then what I'd like to try to do at this point is go back to the Edit Captions tab and try to edit the actual timing of our captions and also um, make sure that we kind of keep it all on one line. Of course, you don't have to do this. You can have it on two lines if you want to, but this is just my personal preference. And you can see how this one is kind of put on two lines now. Um, so let's kind of add it right here. Add a new one right here. So now let's go ahead and take a listen to the first little bit of it. Try and back it up to the beginning here. Now gaining connections and building your network on LinkedIn is great, but it's not everything. In order to build that community that you need to have on LinkedIn and also build your personal brand, you need to be creating thought leader content. All right, so that's honestly looking pretty good. Um, but if you want to, what you can do is basically click on these different caption breaks and adjust the timing of um, how fast they appear. So this one, I noticed that it kind of came on just a little bit too soon. So let's kind of move it up a little bit and hopefully we can get it to right after the logo disappears. Now gaining connections and building your network on LinkedIn is great but it's not everything. In order to... So that one's just a hair too soon. Great, right. but it's not everything. In order to build that community that you need to have on LinkedIn and also build your personal brand, you need to be... That one's a little bit too soon as well. Your personal brand, you need to be creating thought leader content. This and so yeah, that's looking pretty good so far. And of course, I'm a little bit more of a perfectionist, so I like the timing to be right on. But if you don't care about that, it actually does a pretty good job on its own. So the last thing, once we're done editing our captions and editing the style of our video, we can go ahead and click the download button. So let me click render and download. So for me personally, I like having the captions kind of burned into the bottom of the video like you saw there. But let's say that you actually want to utilize LinkedIn's captioning feature. They actually have one built in, but it requires that you upload a transcription file or an SRT file. So basically, you've just uh, generated your SRT file with this software. You can click this button and download it. Let me go ahead and show you on LinkedIn where we can go and paste in that SRT file. And so I'm actually going to use just the original video file that I uploaded. I'm not going to use the whole uh, video that I just uh, captioned and everything. And here is where we can upload our SRT file. Let's find it here where it says transcript, open, and save. And so now what I can do, if I want to, I'm not going to... Um, go ahead and edit everything, but we'll just kind of um, copy and paste this whole uh, transcript into the post here. Of course, it won't let me do the whole thing, but close enough. And then we have our caption file uploaded. So let's click post and see what this looks like. All right, let's go ahead and take a quick look at this. Gaining connections and building your network on LinkedIn is great, but it's not everything. And so now what you're seeing here is basically closed captions. That means you can kind of turn them on and off, and this is through LinkedIn's platform itself. So now that we've looked at this, I mean, this is pretty cool, but personally, I like actually having the captions burned in and kind of designing my video and making it match my branding. So now let's head back over to Subtitle and see if our video is done rendering. Yep, so we can go ahead and click here to download. And now we have our LinkedIn captions burned in. But it's not everything. In order to build that community that you need to have on LinkedIn and also build your personal brand, you need to be creating thought leader content. 
So I really have found no better way to add captions to my LinkedIn videos than with Zubtitle. So if you want to sign up, I'll provide a link in the description below, and there you can caption your first LinkedIn video for free. If you did find this valuable, be sure and hit that like button and subscribe to get more tips like this in the future. And lastly, be sure and reach out to me on LinkedIn to let me know you saw this video and let's connect. Thanks a lot and I'll catch you next time.